Thanks, Julie. An annual event that showcases the tastiest aspects of a mountain town is taking on a new name and a new goal. News 13's Victoria Dunkel is live in Black Mountain this morning. So, Vic, why is Taste of Black Mountain changing its name? Well, because it has to play into the wonderful idea that this is a little town that rocks. In fact, we're sitting on the rocking chairs here with Bob McMurray. You are the executive director, director of the Black Mountain Swannanoa Chamber of Commerce. What's the connection between rocking chairs and the taste uh, that rocks? Well, our new theme for Black Mountain is a little town that rocks. So yes. it's just natural for the Rock the Taste to be our annual taste event, so this year we're calling it Rock the Taste. And it's kind of launching this whole fundraising effort tied to these rocking chairs, right. including this beautiful one right here in the middle. Now this is up for raffle tonight, right? Yes, it's Ann Whisson that painted this for us for the chamber and we'll raffle this off tonight at Rock the Taste. So what's going to happen? We're going to be able to, this is 13 years, I mean people know that the Taste of Black Mountain was a place to go and really experience wonderful culinary options here. Correct. We have wonderful restaurants here in Black Mountain, over 33 restaurants. We have about 15 uh, participating tonight in the Taste of Black Mountain. Wonderful oh. wine and beer, and uh, it's just going to be a great evening. Oh, let me think. Better tell them how they can get in on it, shouldn't we? That's going to be tonight from 5.30 to 7.30, and it is going to be at the White Horse here in Black Mountain. For all the details, you can get tickets in advance. Before it starts this evening, uh, $20. At the door, it's $30. The number's on your screen to call, or you can go to the link at WLOS.com. Click on News Links. Coming up, we're going to talk about a little bit more of the tastes that you'll experience. We're going to, ooh, it looks like there's some cake on a table there over there. Yeah, I can smell mm. it from here. <laughs> Reporting live in Black Mountain, Victoria Dunkel, News 13. All right, thanks, Julie. Well, a new name, but the same chance to sample some of the best foods in the mountains. News 13's Victoria Dunkel is streaming live in Black Mountain this morning. And Vic, you're getting an early sample of tonight's Rock the Taste. Absolutely. I am probably one of the luckiest people on the planet right now because Rock the Taste is a destination you don't want to miss out on. It's an opportunity to really get a sampling of the incredible food, wine, beer, culinary options here in Black Mountain. And I'm actually uh, here with uh, the owner of the Red Rocker Inn. And mm -hmm. we were just talking about um, you have a bed and breakfast. That's right. Mm -hmm. And it is actually open. I can come in. And, uh, I can come and stay and be pampered, mm -hmm. or I can come and have a meal. And yeah. this mm -hmm. is your entry in the best dessert contest, right? This is it this year. This is fresh orange Italian cream cake. Why don't you go ahead and, and sure. tell us what is it you've put mm -hmm. into it while you mm -hmm. give us a little look at the inside of it, okay. if you don't mind. Well, this is three layers of Italian cream cake, just a classic cake recipe. Mm -hmm. uh, fresh orange curd that lots of Yum. fresh orange peel. Oh, great, there you great go. In the peel. Squeezing the juice. It's a She's little bit a lot of work labor this. intensive here. And the cream cheese icing, a little bit of coconut on top. Now, you are entering this in the best dessert contest, correct? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. And you've done the actual, it used to be called Taste of Black Mountain. Now it's Rock the Taste. Mm -hmm. You have done this uh, seven this years? Seventh year. Mm -hmm. Okay, the event itself is 13 years old. What's it like when you serve up something that looks like that? Check it out. Look at these layers. Oh, my goodness. What's it like? Well, this is an, an impressive guest. Um, the cake. Our, our, yeah, our guests love this. And um, it's fun at the taste because we get to see all the people in town that mm -hmm. may or may not normally come to your restaurant. So take a bite and see what you think. Join me, too, because, sure. uh, you know, I love to watch a chef enjoy his or her mm -hmm. creation. And I'm going to take a taste, and then I'm going to tell you how to get involved. <laughs> Your mouth is watering. Oh. You like that? That is amazing. Okay, you want to go, when you get there, check out Red Rocker mm -hmm. and, and try the cake. Mm. It's tonight at 5.30 mm. at the White Horse in Black Mountain. Tickets in advance are $20. At the door, it's $30. And this is all tied to the great new fundraiser that's going on. And you'll have a chance to win one of the painted rocking chairs that are showing up all over town. And that's part of the fundraising effort to build a new town square right here in Black Mountain. So you can sit on the rocker and enjoy a beautiful piece of cake from the Red Rocker Inn right in downtown Black Mountain. Not a bad deal. Coming up, a little more food, a little more reason for you to come out to rock the taste tonight. Reporting live in Black Mountain, Victoria Dunkel News 13. A local competition gives you the power to decide the best of the best food and beverages. News 13's Victoria Dunkel is streaming live in Black Mountain this morning. Victoria, you have another sample from a rock the taste event tonight? 
That's right. It is uh, Rock the Taste. You may remember it as Taste of Black Mountain, but in its 13th year this year, they changed the name to tie into a special fundraiser to help get a brand new town square here. It's tied to these beautiful rocking chairs that you'll see all over town. But Marcus Duarte from Red Radish to Go is here to talk about the taste part of Rock the Taste. That's right. Um, you're going to be competing. Uh, there's so many categories. There's the best uh, t food, best dessert, best in show. Correct. And, and what are we going to have as a, a sampling this morning? So we want to do uh, reach out and do a little bit of a local bite this, uh, for tonight. And mm -hmm. so what we did is a uh, sunburst trout farm um, mm. dip. We're going to move this to the side so they can see Great. what you're doing. And we're going to do that on Herb Cristini. Yeah. And so we take a little um, smoked trout and we add some, uh, just some different things to that. Are those caramelized onions? Little caramelized Ooh. onions, and we've got a little uh, sour cream and mayonnaise. It is not a fat-free dish by any means. But it's just a taste It's tonight, just a right? taste, that's right. <laughs> and we're going to do a little uh, Parmesan cheese and some white cheddar. And for people who might not be familiar with Red Radish to Go, this is where he does the cooking, you grab it, take it home, and serve it for dinner, and everyone goes, wow, you're amazing. And we yeah. say... It's our little secret with Mark. It's, uh, That's it's right. just amazing. That's right. It's been a nice little addition to town here in Black Mountain. Great food. So we're going to mix that up, and we're going to put it on a little herb crostini mm. that our pastry chef has made, our baker's made at our Red Radish to Go store. I'm going to have you go ahead and get that on the crostini for me while I tell them how you can get a chance to try Great. some of this yourself tonight. Uh, the Rock the Taste is from 5.30 to 7.30 at the White Horse in Black Mountain. Uh, tickets before the event starts today, if you call or go to the website early, it's $20. If you wait till tonight at the door it's $30 uh -huh. but you don't want to wait and miss your chance to try some of this delicious food Very oh my nice. goodness I'm gonna give it a taste this is beautiful Good. we'll be back live in the next half hour with some more dessert here Good. we go live in Black Mountain Victoria Dunkle News 13 yeah cool but not snowing yeah thankfully well a new name but the same chance to sample some of the best foods in the mountains. News 13's Victoria Dunkle is streaming live in Black Mountain and Vic we're wrapping up our early sampling of tonight's rock of the taste Absolutely, and um, we have been tasting all kinds of sweet treats, a little savory. Now we're back for some more sweet cupcakes this time. Courtney King and Gabriel Vestash are sisters, and you all own, what's the greeting? Hey, hey, hey cupcake. cupcake. Isn't that great? Doesn't that make you smile? <laughs> Their cupcakes make you smile, too. So you're going to have a table tonight at Rock the Taste. You are kind of the newbies. It's a 13th annual event. They changed the name to tie into the great rocking chair fundraiser for the Newtown Square. But this is only going to be your second year at the event, right? That's correct. So you're new to the cupcake business, but you are no strangers to great taste, right? That's correct. What's your signature element? We Today we're going to be... Um, Featuring a Pisgah Nitro Stout cupcake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's made from Pisgah Brewing Company's Nitro. Nice. And we also have what we have today is a sour wood honey and lavender cupcake. Oh, what lovely local mm -hmm. flavors. Okay, so these don't, uh, no offense, those look a little prettier. Can we get these ready for a uh, show? What's your secret for frosting? Okay, so um, you're going to have to apply um, constant pressure. Uh huh. And I'm just going to swirl this like a rose. That's beautiful. So, all would right. you like to give it a shot? Okay, I'll trade you. You take that, and I'm going to tell you right now, I, I don't know about this. I've never used a, a frosting <laughs> bed. Squeeze from thing. the bottom. Squeeze from the bottom. Yeah. Okay. And start in the middle there. Oh, and squeeze it from the top. That's not good. There you go. I need a little more frosting in there. There you go. Okay. You know what, guys? I'm going to tell you right now. I'm kind of glad you're doing all of this, because... That's not as pretty. That's good. not a bad first try. That is a perfect first so try. So maybe I could come over. They're in the old barber shop here in town. So maybe I could come over sometime and just, you know, apprentice. Absolutely. Best thing to do, though, is come out tonight. The event is Rock the Taste, and it is in Black Mountain at the White Horse. And it's from 530 to 730. You'll get to meet the sisters here, and they'll say, Hey, hey, cupcake. Isn't that great? I'm sorry. That just makes my day. Go out there tonight. Tickets ahead of time, $20, $30 at the door. And you also get to find out how you can get in on a chance to uh, own one of these beautiful hand-painted rockers. Mm -hmm. We have all the details at WLOS.com. Click on news links. Reporting live in Black Mountain, Victoria Dunkel, News 13.